Welcome to episode one of Quick Tips. Uh, this series is designed similarly to my quick riff videos, but instead of riffs uh, from existing songs, I'll be doing brief demonstrations of various techniques, gear, effects, and other fun guitar stuff that you might enjoy. In episode one, we're going to cover a basic rhythmic delay. I'm playing it through the axe effects um, so I can dial in exactly what I want, but you can really do this with any delay pedal. It can be even a really basic, like a boss delay pedal or something. I am going to be using an existing riff to demonstrate this, but the goal isn't the riff or the song, it's really the idea and the effect I'm using behind it. So this rhythmic delay I'm talking about is a common trick to do with a delay um, that has like a dotted eighth note value. So with certain delay pedals and certain delay effects, you're able to control after you hit, uh, hit a note, uh, the delay will um, repeat what you just did um, that's what a delay is. But again, with certain um, types of delays, you can set the tempo so whatever tempo you kind of tap in or dial in, it will hit a rhythm after that um, in a specific time that you want. So the basic, the most basic idea would be, um, say, like an, a quarter note delay. So a quarter note delay would be like taking, let's see, if I dial in a quarter note, I get, I hit the note and it just hits a repeat a quarter note after. So my tempo is this, so so it just hits it quarter note afterwards. And then the feedback is how many repeats you know there would be after that. So what I'm going to do is put it to an eight dotted eighth note delay. Um, you can also just find a shorter delay um, if you don't have the subdivisions on your delay pedal. What that's going to sound like with the same timing is this. So it's just a quicker delay. But if the song's that speed, you kind of get that rhythmic effect. So I'm going to be using uh, the example of the song The Lottery by the Afghan Wigs, just because I'm like obsessed with this record right now. And uh, so again, I'm not trying to teach you the riff. I'm just going to show you what that rhythmic delay will sound like in context. So let's listen to the song, and I'll play with it. And then afterwards, we'll talk a little bit more. Let's uh, hear that without the song. It's going to sound like this. So again, it's just a quick delay. I have the mix level set kind of high so that, you know, the delay is just about as loud as, as the note I hit instead of it decaying real quick um, and being kind of more subtle. Um, the other thing is I have a couple repeats. Sometimes people do this with like one repeat um, or a lot of repeats. I kind of somewhere in the middle um, just to kind of give it a little bit more ambience because that's the way the song sounds to me. And there's also a little reverb in there um, to give it even more ambience. So um, that's basically it. Uh, that dotted eighth note sound is used kind of all over the place. But, uh, you know, there's other rhythmic delays you can do with different um, sort of rhythmic values that, uh, that are fun too.